Tom? Wait for me. Philip? Something is ailing you, isn't it? Philip, you told me in Cuthbert once that if you became prior, you would want the novices to be treated well. Unlike how Remigius treated Brother Marcus before he left us. Remember? It was the day little Jonathan came to us. Yes, I remember. He was so little. You achieved what you set out to do, and so much more. If only Cuthbert was still here with us to see this. Milius, we have not had time to talk since I returned. There was time, but you avoided it. I have a bad feeling about all this. Why? For once, all is well. I haven't seen my brother Francis in a long time. I am afraid. For him. For all of us. But it's not just that. No? I think I've lost my faith. You? Let us talk later, like we used to. Yes, of course. We will. Are you not coming, Remigius? I have pressing matters to attend to, my prior. All right. And what kind of surprise is it? Well, I think you'll be amazed, both of you. Ooh, now I'm curious. When can we see it? I should be done this afternoon. Come on, Jonathan. Let's have a look at the bear. Yes, please. Have fun, boys. Any idea what he's up to? I have no idea. Father! Jack took tools from the site. I don't know what he did with them, but I know he took them. Well, you two won't get a chance to quarrel in the future. Philip will see to that. But Jack is not the only one to blame in this. Martha, have you seen Jack? He went with Jonathan to see the bear fight. With Jonathan? That's dangerous. What is he thinking? Oh. Soft to the touch and yet sturdy. Oh, by the way, I've heard from Sir Catface. Is he all right? The message didn't say, but I assume he's fine. Why's that? He says he needs me to buy him a new horse. <laughs> that is a deal. Look at him go! Mm. Are you sure you want to see this? Of course. What a show. Why did the bear and dog fight? It's in their nature. The beast that is more clever and stronger wins. No. For them, there is no winning. Jonathan! Come here. You shouldn't have brought him here. It's dangerous. I'm always doing something wrong no matter what I do. If Alfred had brought him here, I, I bet there wouldn't have been a problem. There would have. Maybe it's better if you and Jonathan go. <sighs> Come on. Jack. What? I know how you feel. Oh, really? The world is unjust. We are like these poor animals. Forced to tear at each other's flesh. It is a game that they force us to play. Who? Tom? No. The kings and empresses. Even the bishop. Tom 
and all of us, are made to live in an unjust world in which we are forced to make unjust decisions again and again. And we don't even know we are playing their game. You have every right to be angry. But there is a way to remove yourself from that cage. Perhaps not for the sake of God, but for the sake of man. What do you mean? I want you to become a monk. 